Warriors hosting the Heat, and the Warriors are two and a half point home favorites. The over under is at 227 and a half. The Heat are plus 116 on the money line, and the Warriors are minus 136. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. Or if one of these teams decide that they're going to say a key player is not playing instead of a game time decision, that'll also affect the odds. Now, as far as the lineups are concerned, it's supposed to be Lowry, Hero, Jax, Butler, and Bam. Lowry is listed as questionable with soreness, just says soreness. And then Jimmy is listed as questionable with a left calf injury. And then it's supposed to be Curry, Podzeminski, Thompson, Kuminga, and Looney. Lineups have not been confirmed. I bitch about this in every NBA video. They wait until like an hour before the tip to announce them. These teams have not played each other yet this year. This is their first meeting. Head to head, they are 5-5 five and five against each other. The home team's on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 8-2. and two. The favorite has won and covered the last two games. The favorite is 8-2 and two on the money line. The favorite is 6-4 and four against the spread. The over is 8-2. and two. However, the under 227.5 is 6-4. and four. The Heat are 7-3 and three in their last 10, 5-5 five and five against the spread. And the over is 6-4 and four in their last 10. They have won and covered their last three games that they've played. There was a total of 220. 221, 235, and then 232 points in their last four games. They lost by four, they won by nine, they won by nine, and then they won by six. For the Warriors, they are six and four in their last 10, five, four, and one against the spread, and the over is six and four in their last 10. And they are three, zero, and one against the spread, and I'll just call that three and one because I'm not calling that Wizards game a push. They were higher than that before Poole hit that meaningless uh, shot at the end of the game. There was a total of 258, then 247 points, 232, and then 234. They won by six. They won by nine. Uh, they, won by, they won by six. Then they won by 11, forgive me. Then they won by 20, and then they lost by six to the Nuggets, which kind of no surprise there. They generally play each other close. I have more trust in the Heat when Butler isn't in the lineup. It just seems like their team clicks differently. And now the fact that they have Hero back, that's just another 20-point scorer that they have. The Warriors are going to go as far as Steph Curry carries them. And if he doesn't hit four or five threes in a game and score 25 points, their offense is going to be non-existent. I'm going to take the Heat with the money line. I'm going to take the Heat getting the points. And I know everything says go under, but both of these teams in their last handful of games have been trending over. So I'm going over in this one. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.